top 10 blockbusters of the summer of 1982. At number 10, Porky. In 1954, a group of Florida high school guys try to help their buddy lose his virginity, which leads them to seek revenge on a sleazy nightclub owner and his redneck sheriff brother for harassing them. Number 9, Conan the Barbarian. Crush your enemies, see them driven before you, and they hear the lamentation of your women. A powerful warrior seeks to avenge the genocide of his people and the murder of his parents at the hands of a snake cult. Number 8, an officer and a gentleman. I got nowhere else to go! A young man must complete his work at a Navy officer cadet school to become an aviator with the help of a tough gunnery sergeant and his new girlfriend. Number seven, Firefox. It's got a one of you who think I have a chance in the world pulling this off, is A pilot is sent to the Soviet Union on a mission to steal a prototype jet fighter that can be partially controlled by a Neuralink. Number six, Annie. Spunky young orphan is taken in by a rich eccentric, much to the chagrin of the cantankerous woman who runs the orphanage. Number five, the best little whorehouse in Texas. A town sheriff and a regular patron of the historical whorehouse fights to keep it running when a television reporter targets it as the devil's playhouse. Number four, poltergeist. Family's home is haunted by a host of demonic ghosts. Number three, Star Trek II, The Wrath of Khan. With the assistance of the Enterprise crew, Admiral Kirk must stop an old nemesis, Khan Nunyan Singh, from using a life-generating Genesis device as the ultimate weapon. Number two, Rocky III. But I pity the fool. Rocky faces the ultimate challenge from a powerful new contender and must turn to a former rival to help regain his throne as the undisputed fighting champion. And the number one, E.T. the Extraterrestrial. A troubled child summons the courage to help a friendly alien escape from Earth and return to its home planet. Thanks for watching. See you next summer. Here endeth the lesson.